All right. Well, welcome to Amazon Live. And uh, we're going to be talking about Cord Buddy today. And so this is it's going to be fun. I'm going to turn this up just a little bit so uh, we can uh, have fun. I got the uh, I got a Perry guitar. Now I'm going to go ahead and highlight that in the carousel here. So let me just uh, get the, that set up. The Chord Buddy, this is the complete package that we've got highlighted in the carousel. And uh, you can see we've got the Chord Buddy on here. And I'm going to show you why this is actually a guitar learning system. And Travis Perry is going to be joining us a little bit later. He is actually the inventor, founder, owner of Chord Buddy. He's there in Dothan, Alabama. You may remember he was on Shark Tank a number of years ago and won a deal with Robert Herjavec. He had been teaching guitar for many years. And as a teacher, he was discouraged. And when he first started teaching, he, uh, he was discouraged because so many people quit. So many of his students were quitting. And uh, he was talking to uh, uh, another uh, music, or a music store owner and saying, that he was going to quit teaching guitar because uh, all of his students quit. Well, turns out that 70% uh, of people quit uh, in the first month or two. They just, uh, they don't stick with it. And although most people, in fact, it's something like 95% of people want to play guitar, but they just never get to it. Uh, or they get started, and uh, for some reason, they just... Don't stick with it. Uh, and in many cases, it's maybe it's a bad guitar, it's a bad teacher, or it's just uh, there's a lot going on. So when, when you're playing guitar, you have the rhythm side, and that's uh, strumming. So that's the... So how you strum can be a difference. And so you want to you want to learn that rhythm on how to strum, and you're also trying to finger the chords here. So you're trying to play chords. Well, trying to do all of that, trying to do the rhythm and finger the chords, is a, a lot to learn. It's like patting your head and. Uh, uh, rubbing your stomach and uh, jumping on one foot and uh, reciting the alphabet all at one time. It's just a ton of stuff going on. So uh, Travis had this idea. And then 20 years later, he was helping his daughter learn how to play guitar. And she was a little frustrated and uh, for the same reasons that everyone is. And he explained to her, this idea that he's had for 20 years on how to make the chord buddy. And she said, well, daddy, why don't you make one for me? So that night they got some popsicle sticks and uh, uh, some other stuff and uh, actually made the first prototype of a chord buddy. And uh, they played this G chord just like that using uh, some popsicle sticks and uh, some rubber grommets. And, uh, there you have it. They had the first the first chord buddy. But the, the magic isn't just that you can push a button and play a chord, play that G chord or a D chord or C or E minor. Now, with those four chords, you can play tens of thousands of songs. You can write your own songs. So you're not really limited. The chord buddy is a learning system. And let me show you what that means. So if you were to uh, to play the, uh, the strings for a D chord, then there's uh, three places where you put your fingers. 
and you put those on there. And that's how you play a D chord. You put there's uh, three spots uh, on the top three strings, and you play the four strings down here. And that's a D chord. Well, you can finger that here. But then you've got to also learn the rhythm. And so with the Chord Buddy, it's got this tab, which I've taken out. And you see there's these uh, little rubber grommets there on that. You can see those little three. It's kind of in a diamond or a V pattern. And that's the way you put your fingers on the strings. Now, this, those pads, those gray pads there, mimic your fingers on the strings. <laughs> So now what you can do is when you start using Chord Buddy, and when you buy the Chord Buddy, we've got the um, it's highlighted in the, the carousel. So what you can do then is learn the rhythm because there's a there's a song book, there's a lesson a plan in with Chord Buddy. So whether you're buying the complete package with the guitar and the tuner and the Chord Buddy and the whole learning system, or you're buying just the learning system which includes the Chord Buddy, which goes on most guitars. And in fact, uh, this uh, Stratocaster, this Fender right back here, uh, that the Chord Buddy works on that. It works on this headless guitar. This is a, a Steinberger guitar, this electric guitar. I can put the Chord Buddy, I have put the Chord Buddy on this electric guitar, on that headless guitar. And uh, it plays just fine. So when you buy the Chord Buddy, you get the complete Chord Buddy, you get the songbook, the lesson plans, and then there's online video lessons that walk you through and uh, follow the book lessons where you learn the rhythms. And Travis teaches you the different strumming patterns. <laughs> As you go through and learn those different strumming patterns, then you're also strengthening your hand, but you're not worrying about exactly where all your fingers are going as you're putting them on the strings here, but you're getting used to that, and you're matching up, moving your hand here on the neck and practicing your rhythm. So let me just uh, see if I can share this here, and uh, so you can kind of see that uh, we've got the the chord buddy and so as i play as i go from the g c to an e minor those are the different dots different colored dots and so uh there's song books and uh there is a lot of song books out there hal leonard is the publisher a music publisher and they've got uh lots of songbooks for chord buddy that's available out there so anything that you're interested in uh, we also have a really good community uh, in the chord buddy so you can work with each other and learn more songs so we have a lot of people sharing music with each other so as you're playing <laughs> So I'm playing the uh, chord buddy. I'm le I'm learning the rhythm. I'm learning how to play the guitar, but I'm playing right out of the box. And this is what's really fascinating: is you're able to take your chord buddy, put it on your guitar, or bring get the complete chord buddy kit uh, with a guitar. With this, this is uh, the Perry guitar. Uh, by the way, uh, Travis has a lot of guitars in stock. Uh, he was smart, got a bunch of them delivered uh, before all of the supply chain problems. Uh, so guitars are ready to go. And he also personally uh, tests every guitar, make sure that it's uh, ready to play right out of the box. So when you get it home, uh, you put the tuner on there and uh, get it tuned up, put the chord buddy on, and you're able to play right away. <laughs> Yeah.
and you can do that right away. Now, as you learn guitar, as you learn, then you start to remove the tabs. And so in this case, we took out that D tab. That is the first one that comes out. And then you start playing like you were. But for that D chord, instead of using the tab, you're actually going to put your fingers on the strings. So now you're actually using your fingers on the strings. That's why this is actually a learning system. So you're not just, it's not just using the chord buddy. Now there are people who use these and we've just got some stories uh, at chord buddy. We just had a, a veteran that uh, sent a story that said he played guitar, but uh, due to uh, nerve damage that he had suffered uh, while uh, overseas and uh, deployed, he was no longer able to play guitar. But with Chord Buddy, he was able to do that again. And so it's just one of those great stories. And, and uh, Chord Buddy Travis does uh, donate uh, quite a number of uh, guitars and Chord Buddies uh, to our veterans. And so uh, one of the things, if you remember watching the episode on Shark Tank, and I, I should have added that uh, episode in, you can actually watch... The episode, it's season three, uh, episode three of Shark Tank. And Robert Herjavec, uh was uh, amazed. He was able to play right away. And so uh, you can do the same thing. So you've, you're learning the rhythm. And then you're actually putting your fingers on the strings and playing and then as you do that now you move and you'll remove the next tab and so now we're going to take out the c tab and so there's uh, three spots where you put your fingers there to play the strings but uh so we're playing and now you're actually going to put your fingers on the strings and play that play that c chord and so when you do that now you're you're actually getting used to using your fingers on the strings and still playing that rhythm so you're you're actually learning how to do this. Then the next tab you would pull out would be the G tab. And so uh, we take out this G tab. And again, there's three spots uh, where you put your fingers on the strings in these little rubber uh, grommets on the bottom tabs, the little footies there. They replace your fingers on the string. So now we're going to play with uh, your fingers. So see how I've gone from using uh, three different tabs to uh, push the buttons to play my uh, chords on the chord buddy, on the guitar, using the chord buddy. Now I've pulled those out and I'm actually using the strings. Now this is a process that can take, uh, uh, the lesson plans call for about two months. Now some people are able to do this much quicker uh, some people take longer. And again, some people just decide just to continue to use the chord buddy. Now I've seen I've seen worship leaders at church, at churches, who continue to they're up leading worship songs playing with the chord buddy. And uh and they love it. And uh so we've got uh, some folks here, uh Central Florida and uh Jacques saying, love my chord buddy. Glad to see that. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, thank you for the comments. And uh, it's great to see you guys here. Thank you for joining us. Uh, uh, we uh, Travis is, is uh, called out. He's going to be uh, hopefully joining us here in a little bit. And we'll uh, have him talk a little bit and play some uh, music with the chord buddy as well. One of the things that we've been wanting to do, and we're going to do these uh, live Amazon videos each week. 
here on Thursday here on Amazon Live. And, uh, of course, we're pushing out to a couple of different places. Um, oh, I see. Yeah. Uh, you're a vet. Should have let them know. Well, uh, yeah, let us know what's going on. I'll, I'll just say uh, Travis uh, sends out an email to every person that uh, purchases a cord buddy. And uh, I will give his email right now. It's Travis at CordBuddy.com. So when Travis was on Shark Tank and Robert Herjavec was there, he, uh, of course, uh, Mr. Wonderful, right? Kevin was saying, why don't you make these in Asia? It'd be a lot cheaper. Well, all of these Cord Buddies are made in the U.S. And in fact, most of these parts actually are made uh, in Dothan, Alabama, and the books are printed right there. Uh, I've had the privilege to go down and visit the plant, to uh, watch the cord buddies be made, to go to the plastic injection molder uh, where they're making these cord buddies and to the printers where they're printing the books. So there's a lot of jobs in the U.S. that uh, are tied directly to cord buddy. A lot of these businesses uh, are... Uh, a big portion of their business is supplying parts with the cord buddy. So this is uh, right here in the U S the cord buddy. And that was one of the things that Travis wanted to do. And now this was, uh, um, he's been selling these for a number of years, over 10 years. There's, um, lots of folks, half a million folks, maybe that, uh, have purchased a cord buddy over the years and have, uh, told us great stories about about using those and so um it is uh it is a great learning system and that's really what makes cord buddy not a cheat and uh, some people that uh, have been musicians and playing for years and i'll say have forgotten what it took to become a guitar player to the level that they're at they forgot the frustration uh, and what it took to get through. And uh, Cord Buddy can help people out. So this is one of the reasons why I'm a, a really big fan. And I remember watching that first episode of Shark Tank, Season 3, Episode 3. Uh, you can find that right here on Amazon. And uh, next week I'll make sure and add that into the carousel so that... Uh, uh, those of you that are interested in watching that can get that episode of Shark Tank. Season 3, Episode 3, when Travis won a deal with Robert Herjavec. In fact, uh, he got deals from all of the Sharks, except Mark Cuban. Well, Mark said, you know, uh, Robert is really the guy to go with. But he would have given him a deal uh, if he hadn't uh, seen the other folks out there. So, uh, Because it's a great product. This is something that it makes learning guitar easy because you can start playing right away now most instruments it's going to take um it could take years to be able to play one song on um on an instrument so if you're going to play trumpet or flute uh to play a song and uh you can't uh, really get on with those so uh with Chord Buddy, you're able to play right out of the box. So if you buy the complete package, you're able to play songs and because you've got the guitar, the tuner, the Chord Buddy learning system, which has the um, which has the Chord Buddy, the songbooks, the lesson plans, everything that you need, and. And uh, I was just looking at the comments here, uh, the two-month thing. That's kind of a an estimated time. And, uh, hey, Travis has joined us here, so I'm going to change my camera around. And uh, let's bring Travis in. And, uh, hey, Travis, welcome. Hey, hey Scott. <laughs> Hello, Amazon. And I, I'm so sorry for being late. I had... No, we are I'm, good. We're good. My daughter, I would was getting her a mailbox for her new apartment we're building and yeah I held up at Lowe's. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, it's, it's good. We're glad to have you here. And, um, yeah, we were just having some comments. Uh, uh, we got uh, Facebook and YouTube and of course the people here on Amazon live. And, um, we was just, uh, one of the comments was, uh, 
we've got uh, someone from uh, Central Florida and uh, uh, says that uh, he is a vet. We were talking about how some of the veterans, uh, in fact, we just had a story recently uh, about a vet that uh, is able to play because of Cord Buddy. Yeah. He said, "Oh, I should have let Travis know when I got my my cord buddy that I was a veteran." So, uh, but we do thank you for your service. Uh, and uh, one of the comments he says, "When I got mine, I looked at the videos, and I don't see it being uh, a two month process." Uh, but it really is kind of uh, up to you, right, Travis, on those on those lessons. Yeah, I've, I, I mean, I literally have seen someone uh, use it and be off of it within two weeks. Mm-hmm. Now, granted, they worked on it about six hours a day, <laughs> and yeah. uh, and and then there's people that that you know it takes six months. But as I've always said, it's not a race. You know, right. just take it at your pace, whatever pace that is, ever how much time that you have to to spend with it. Uh, you know, is if you can, you know, fifteen to. 15 to 30 minutes a day is, is what we like to see, but you know, it, it, it's up to you, you know, and there's people that always, uh, that never take it off. Although that's not what it, it's intention. Uh, we have a lot of people that have hand issues, arthritis issues. My mother was one of those. She had mm. not played the, an instrument in almost 20 years Wow! because of crippling rheumatoid arthritis. And, because of chord buddy she was able to play again and literally played the chord buddy in the hospital in her bed uh the day before she passed away wow wow so it was bringing her joy yeah you know it's uh you know travis it's one of those things that uh you talk about how music is that is that constant and how important that is it 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 is you know uh, Friends are come and go, uh, you know, people come into your life and then they're gone. And, and, uh, you know, we cherish those times obviously, but, but music is the, the one constant that will always be with you. It's been with me in my highest of highs. It's been with me in my lowest of lows. So right. uh, it was there to comfort me in times of sorrow. And it was, it was there to, to help me rejoice and celebrate in, in times of happiness. So it will be, I promise you, at, it, learning music is to play the guitar or ukulele or any instrument for that matter will be something that you will never, ever regret. Yeah. You know, that's one of the things, too, is they recommend that uh, people don't, when they're finished playing, that they don't put their guitar uh, in the closet or under the bed. In a, but, don't uh, put, do out. not put it back in a case. Uh, I have, have people ask me, uh, what do I need? I need a stand or a case or a wall hanger like I have here. I said, In- anything but a case. Now, you only put it in a case when you're taking it outside uh, because if you put it in a case, I promise you will find a reason not to get it out in practice. Where if you have it on a wall hanger like this or sitting in a stand beside your chair, it, mm-hmm. you know, while you're watching TV in between commercials, Whatever you can just pick it up and play. I did most of my practicing, Scott, between commercials. Back when we watched commercials and couldn't fast forward through them like we do yeah. now. Mm-hmm. I had my electric guitar sitting there. Uh, didn't have it plugged in because my wife would be in, in the chair beside me. But when a commercial would come on, I'd pick it up and start working mm-hmm. on scales. And, yeah, uh, you know, leaving leaving the guitar out. One of the things is is like if we're gonna go somewhere as a family, uh, typically I'm ready before everyone else, and uh, I can pace around, or I can sit out in the car, or I can just pick up the guitar and uh, take it off the stand and sit there, and uh, I can just noodle around for a little bit, and then say, "Oh, you guys are ready? Okay, let's go." Uh, yeah, put it right back and. Uh, I'm happy and I've got some time playing guitar and uh, it's better than, better than pacing around. So always leave that guitar out. Hey, uh, something that just came to mind, Scott, we are, we're making a couple of new bundles. Uh, Don't have them yet, but we will have a couple of new bundles on to, to, for Amazon. Uh, One of them uh, we're going to include, we already have one with the tuner, but we're going to include a bundle that's got 10 picks 
mm, along uh-huh. with it, and we may in- include a bundle that has uh, the uh, uh, a wall hanger in it. You know, the wall hanger. The other thing that uh, that I like is uh, there's a nice, and this is one of the things that uh, you talk about your daughter Brady. Uh, she put together a nice care kit to, for guitars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That and, and and actually, that's another. That's the other one. So I think we're going to have three new bundles coming to Amazon: one with the care kit, one with the wall hanger, and then one with ten picks. Well, we got a comment here too uh, on uh, YouTube, and uh, uh, Maps Bolt says uh, it's incredible to hear about the opportunities for elders to reconnect with instruments despite physical restrictions, and it's not just age. Uh, there's plenty of uh, folks that maybe have accidents or other conditions, uh, physical abilities that, that make it difficult for them. And I tell you, we have had some great stories from uh, uh, that, that come in from the community. Yeah. I had a, a one, and this was probably about four months ago, but I had, we had a customer buy from the website uh, uh, and they, uh, or they bought, I don't know where they bought actually, but they, they, because even if they buy from Amazon, they, they, uh, they can co- reach me direct. I make sure that they know how to do mm-hmm. that. Uh, but anyway, they got it and, and they weren't happy with it. Uh, it, and now uh, this, this was a, about an 80 year old person. And they said, well, I just can't get it. It's buzzing, it's muting, and, and it, something's wrong with it. And I said, well, I need you to trust me here. I need you to trust what I'm going to tell you. Your mm-hmm. fingers just don't have the strength right now. So work with it and, and just know it take it takes a little more pressure than what you're doing. They contact me. I, t- I said, listen, in two weeks, if you'll do what I'm telling you, two weeks, it'll sound perfect. Got an email two weeks later. They said, what you told me was absolutely correct. <laughs> now my finger strength, and they even said, I can tell it in my everyday life that my hand strength is, is stronger than it used to be. You know, that's, a that's uh, yeah, you know, I hadn't heard that story, but that makes so much sense because uh, as you're, you're playing, and so you're just exercising. It's just exercise. So your hands get stronger. So uh, for everyday use, for all of those things. That's, well, and that's, uh, that's why that's Walter story. Reed uses it in, in their up, upper extremities redevelopment with soldiers that have handed. Would you rather play the guitar or squeeze a rubber ball? <laughs> yeah. Um, and let's see. It's uh, yeah. So we've got another comment. Carl Lance says uh, he's a expat vet living in France, bought his cord buddy or brought his cord buddy with him uh, to France. It's great to fill the downtime. Uh, when I'm having to wait for the weather to get better. <laughs> so uh, that's good. Yeah. You know, uh, and but it's also, you know, as we get into the uh, spring and summer weather, there's nothing like being able to get your guitar out around the uh, campfire or in the backyard and just play a song. Yeah. Well, one of our best retailers that sold the product, they're, they're no longer open. Uh, but for years it was, they were called off flitter for, uh, uh, sportsman's outfitters and Mm -hmm. they were the leading retailer in Dothan, Alabama, beating out music stores even (laughs) because they set up a campfire scene with mannequins, you know, had a, had a thing that Mm -hmm. blows up in the air. looks like a fire going that, and uh, and they had a bench and a log and had a camper sitting there, a little small camper, had a tent over there. And uh, they had a guitar on the mannequin, had his hand placed on the neck, had the kid sitting around him. And because of that, they sold cord buddies <laughs> like crazy. Oh, boy. You know, that's uh, that is so much. That's such a great story. I love uh, I, I just love that. You know, when I was growing up, it was there was always somebody when we were going on those family trips that could pull out an instrument and, and just play. And you can play, you can play new songs. You know, we're not just talking about uh, old campfire songs. So um, there's a, uh, we were showing, uh, playing a song with, uh, by Bruno Mars and uh, just about anything that you can play. There's, 
what tens of thousands of songs that you can play with chord buddy right out of the box yeah yeah Absolutely. and uh you know i'll uh probably when we do these i'll throw some of the uh the chord buddy books that hal leonard offers because they're here on amazon uh some of the different uh song books that uh, are available that are designed specifically for chord buddy yes mm-hmm yeah and then uh as we say uh i i you know, travis i did give out your your email because uh this one of the things that that i think people really like about uh, working with cord buddy as a company is you were the inventor the founder the owner uh and you still uh email everybody directly uh you're accessible so i had given out travis at cord uh because uh we want to hear if you want a song it, we're we're going to be doing these uh amazon live broadcasts uh, each week and uh we want to be able to show you some current songs uh or if there's an old favorite song that you'd like to hear and uh we'll see if we can get that on chord buddy and and have travis do a little little uh uh demonstration yeah yeah a little tutorial be, be happy to sure will. <laughs> that's great all right learning to play for when i go fishing yeah that's a map says that's another that's yeah that's great you know anytime uh you've got time to to uh to relax a little bit uh let your mind wander and relax and um there's nothing like music there's nothing yeah. like it i'll tell a quick story i know we're we're rapidly approaching mm-hmm. our cutoff time but i was camping in panama city florida Mm-hmm. And uh, so I had my guitar and I was sitting out playing and uh, a guy walked by and and he uh, came up and we were talking, you know, and he said, man, I've always wanted to play the guitar. And I said, well, I said, tell you what, today's your lucky day. <clears throat> so I went in and I got, got a chord buddy. I always carry a couple of chord buddies with me, put it on. Well, with it literally, literally within 30 seconds, he was playing his first song. <laughs> he couldn't believe it turned out <clears throat> he was the co-owner of this campground oh. now mm-hmm. they have actually are having jam sessions once a week uh because of, of that you know that's great i can i can see where um people would have uh it, where they could put some you know uh, campsites maybe they have some games and some things in the in the rec center you put a guitar and a chord buddy in there <laughs> you well, that. that's exactly right i mean i i was walking by that afternoon and he had about six people at at the uh the, the where they eat breakfast they was all sitting around right outside the door there at the pool in their little rec room like you said sitting around playing and singing with cord <laughs> that's perfect yeah angie t says uh i'm a uk bet vet and got cord buddy a month ago and uh hopes to surprise the family so yeah yeah, that's uh being able to play a song um yeah uh yeah so oh he's got the christmas songs book you know that's that's a great thing that's there's a lot of those songs there's some uh, very specific song books out there there's uh christmas and worship and um boy i tell you I forget what all the books are, Travis. <laughs> uh, we've got a, about, well, Christmas and, and worship, and then we've got p- several pop hits, I think, three three pop hits. Mm-hmm. So. Yeah. So, and those those songbooks are packed full of songs. And so uh, you, you won't get bored. <laughs> You're not going to run out of songs to play. Uh, and uh, it's a lot of fun. Well, Travis, this is it's always great to uh, hang out with you. Thank you for uh, joining us here. Well, and, you're welcome. Uh, Sorry I was late to the party, but uh, <laughs> I'll try not to try not to do that again. No, we're good. It gave me a chance to uh, go through and kind of show how uh, how you pull those tabs out and start by, uh, as you said, strengthening your hand, just like the story that you told with the, that uh, one lady, and then uh, well, and see that happens in the background. You know, you don't realize that that you're getting stronger, you know, because you're working on your rhythm and timing. Well, there's a lot going on here that's in the background, you know, hand eye mm-hmm. coordination, dexterity between your fingers and hand strength is all going on while you're learning your rhythm and timing. Yep. 
Yep. Yeah. And so uh, that's always fun. So, uh, well, uh, Travis, thanks. Thanks so much yeah. for, for coming in today. And I just want to thank for all the folks that we have been watching and we're here on Amazon every Thursday. And so that is at 9 a.m. Central Time. And uh, we'll come on for about a half hour and be able to just talk about Chord Buddy and share some songs. And uh, with that, I think, Travis, I've got a, um, I've got the video. Let me just take a look here. Uh, I'm hoping that I got the one with you showing how to play a hound dog. Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, you want to go out with? That's it. You know, uh, yeah, everyone's got to, uh, you, you got to love um, some of these, uh, the, the traditional songs there. And well, I guess I, uh, I thought I had it, but apparently I, I don't. Oh, wait a minute. I, I know. I think I've got it right here. Um, yeah, there we go. Let's get, let's find that one. And that's what we'll go out with this week. Uh, so Travis, thanks again. Okay. We will uh, we'll see you next week, and uh, also remind people there's the podcast, so you can follow Travis and the story of Cord Buddy on the podcast. So with that, we'll go out with uh, with Hound Dog. Everyone All have right. a fabulous day. See you next week. Going to teach you an Elvis Presley all-time great mega hit. You ain't nothing but a hound dog. The song, not you. I, I, I'm, I didn't mean you. I meant the song. <laughs> uh, this is going to incorporate some techniques that is not on your Chord Buddy DVD. Um, it's called the pedal move, and the pedal move would be when you advance. If you're playing a, a boogie woogie like a. Uh, uh, well, when I go down with my pinky there, that's called pedaling, okay? So what we're going to do here on the G is you're going to hold the, the blue down, target the top three strings, six, five, and four, and you're going to pick it twice, strum it twice, and then you're going to keep the blue pressed and add the yellow to it. See? And that makes uh, a boogie-woogie pattern, shuffle pattern. When you go to the green, you're going to press it with your middle finger, target the fifth, fourth, and third string. And you're going to uh, pedal to the red. All right. When you go to the red, the D chord, you're going to target the bottom four. And that's, that's uh, your pattern for this, okay? Uh, again, I'm using... Um, uh, garage band drum loops. This is uh, it is the funky shuffle drum set pattern 21. And all you do is you set your tempo to what you want it to be, and you hit it, and it plays the drum beat for you. Very simple. It gets more complex if you want to build tracks and add piano and bass to it. If you want to learn that, please send me an email saying do more garage band, and I'll do my best to do it. Here we go. Hey, pretty funky, isn't it? You ain't nothing but a hound dog.